It's night 83, 21 days to go. Some of the guys are getting ready to go home. It's one of the last big nights of the movie. I'm Lee Ehrenberg. I play Pintel. There I am without my makeup. Disney invited me to keep a video journal of my experiences on the movie. I call it my doc <laughs> spy camera. Yeah, hey, buddy. It's Gore Verbinski, our fearless leader, my good friend. Here he is, seeking me out by the makeup trailer to talk about an upcoming scene. When you guys are looking through the knot hole, yeah. later, I want to make sure that we know who that is. Well, there's a whole thing. I don't see nothing. Right. I want to make sure we know that what this is about. Cool. Yeah. Okay. cool. That's one really cool thing about Gore. He's a general on the set and a real creative genius, but he also takes the time to have the common touch. There's no one else I'd rather be on the earth, like, you know, than making this movie right now. There he is, Vinny St. Vinny, my good buddy, Vince Lozano. And here's Joel Harlow, my makeup artist and one of the most important friends an actor can have. Here's Susan, my lens tech, putting in my 22 mil scleral contact lens. Comfy. <laughs> An hour and a half to two hours every day in the chair. Yeah, any part of exposed skin? Belly button. Yeah. <laughs> Look at those nails, six months. I'd trim them, but I wouldn't cut them. Hey there, Joel, we're ready for leave. All right. I'm ready to give them to you. All right. All right, and that uh, does it. Cool. Let's erupt. Big man, watch out with that sword, man. <laughs> Fellow pirate, is it Jack's sword that's the real sword? There's one real sword and one the Jack's. Uh, no. There's mine. Here's my sword, it's a good sword. We had a great sword master, Errol Flynn's old stunt double, Bob Anderson. It was an amazing process to work out all the stunts and fighting. Angus Barnett, my good buddy, with a piece of Aztec gold. Oh, cool. Dun, dun, that's one of the... Cool, that's one of the Aztec ones. Heads or death. Last day on the movie, man. Yeah, last day on the movie, man. It's your last day? Last day. Hey. I know, man. Unless it all goes wrong tonight. And action! Here we are, storming Port Royal. This was a fun sequence. In rowboats, trying to get the timing right, as explosions are going off, we're trying not to fall in the water, light our beards on fire, or stab each other with swords. And we still want to look like pirates. It was awesome. After I filmed that night, I stuck around because I wanted to watch things explode. So here I am just hanging out and shooting some of the crew. We're here at the Scrabble Tournament. Every day. <laughs> they are intense. Don't mess with Team Scrabble. Never. They're very witchy, these two. <laughs> Queen Bee stuck up there. Four letter words down there, you know? They got two letter words. They, they got, got four letter words. without U's. <laughs> these guys, this is Q without U. <laughs> So how long you been a stuntman, dude? Um, about five years. Stuff, guys. Did you get into it through like martial arts or what? You... Yes, martial arts. Dude, <laughs> I think you rule, dude. We think you rule. <laughs> safety first, though. Definitely safety first. Always, first. man. Yeah. Yep. Cool. Cool. I love when they blow stuff up. It's my favorite. Three, two, one, action! I got it. I love it. <laughs> Boom. Yeah, man. On our days off, we got to explore the island. Here we are in a cove high above looking down on the boats that were in the harbor. On the road with Carlton. So lucky, professional driver. There's Carlton Nichols, our driver. And there's the main highway of St. Vincent. Carlton off the falls at Trinity Falls. Nobody can say that we walked through the rainforest <laughs> and made it to these falls. Right. We're truly off pirates. Truly. <laughs> Montreal Gardens, a plantation estate where you could see some amazing flora and fauna. Look at that amazing caterpillar. There he is. 
Oh, come on, baby. The real one. What a mugger. What a mugger. Isn't this beautiful, honey? It's beautiful. I'm gonna go. I'm going over your shoulder. I got a PC and I got the beard working. Oh, you need the parrot. Where's the parrot? This is the parrot. It's a parrot POV. What is the parrot POV? What shoulder is it usually That's on? That's the line the parrot says. Right. This is what the yeah. parrot sees. This is the parrot's POV. And here we are at the Camelot Inn, our hotel high above Kingston. Kevin McNally cooking dinner for us. Go and see the bubbling mess. It's a beautiful thing to behold. Uh, I'm just about to say that, you know, this is nearing completion, but about half an hour I gave it to the girl from New York and she said that she thought it was good pasta sauce. Girl lives in Tribeca, you cannot say Good that pasta sauce. Huh? This is good from a Brit. It's a bit hot. Ooh. Mm. Mm. All right, here we are, another day in paradise. Working hard, there's the Black Pearl built on a barge. We're just off the coast, but sometimes it would take like a 30 minute boat ride to make it to the set. <laughs> We're in the middle of a tropical depression, as you can see. Here's Chuck Stewart, prop master, storyteller, comedian extraordinaire. The wind's blowing pretty fast. Oh, I'd say about 33 knots. What do you think the wind capacity of the ship is? I think the wind capacity of the ship is about 19,000 pounds with the sails fully deployed. At this point, as you can see, we are fully deployed, but there seems to be a problem. We can't seem to catch the wind because there's some holes in the sail. The beautiful Kira. Amazing 17 year old with more maturity than I'll ever have. Can tell's finest moment right there. <laughs> Captain Jack, why did we ever let him go? He's more fun than Barbosa. I mean, comedy night's much better with. Johnny D, my favorite movie star. Hollywood legend, all around great guy. It's got the, uh, the wide angle. So you're able to yeah, interchange the lens? Yeah. And here's the spout. Quiet, please, here now. Quiet. You can get so tight. But you can get, like, really close. I get all that. That's fine. See the gun? Yeah. That's a really a nice so I can get I can get in there and go like this. I can get that bro, bro. Yeah, it's pretty good. So good. Ooh. Nice, good smoke. Here we go. Okay. Wait him down. Everybody set. Roll camera! And action! My father is bootstrap Bill Tucker. His blood runs in my veins. It's a spitting image of bootstrap Bill. Send back to all us. Hear my buddy Mackenzie Crook illustrates the repetitive nature of filmmaking. His blood runs in my veins. It's a spitting image of bootstrap Bill. Come back to all us. On oh, my word, do as I say. His blood runs in my veins. It's a spitting image of Bootstrap Bill. Come back to haunt us. My father is Bootstrap Bill Turner. His blood runs in my veins. It's a spitting image of Bootstrap Bill. Come back to haunt us. Another day in paradise. At the end of the day, it was a 30-minute boat ride back to shore. Kira took the first one. I took the last. This is Lee Ehrenberg wishing you fair winds and a following sea.